What's good everyone and welcome back to a new video. I know it's been a while since I have uploaded. Like I said, if you guys kept up with um, or followed me on Instagram or I posted this, I don't know when, but uh, I stated that I was going to take a break from cars because, you know, I really want to focus more on school and work and you know, life in general. So uh, the build for, this, for the Lexus is going to be slowed down just a lot more. So, but today I'm going to be working on the spark plugs and a PCV valve. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how to change this out. This is a lot more complicated than the, you know, the six cylinders from Honda and Acura, where the cylinders um, or the spark plugs were just faced out right here, and then three in the back. It was pretty easy. For this one, it's gonna be located on the side right here and right here. So what I've been known or told is that this side should be easier because you could just basically remove the air intake tubing and then you have good access right there but for this side we're gonna have to remove the intake manifold which is gonna be a lot of work uh, because we have to disconnect this side of the portion and then this side and then we have to unbolt the intake manifold right here and then unbolt the, the uh, throttle body right there as well so there's gonna be a lot of work that has to be done including for the pcv valve to be changed so if you guys want to know where i picked these up i picked up at o'reilly's so these two together should be roughly uh to, i paid around 116 dollars so this the spark plugs alone should be like about 100 dollars. pcv valve was, was like under 10 dollars. i think it was like seven dollars eight dollars and then uh, while at it i'm going to be replacing the intake manifold gasket so um, that's what a lot of people are doing, so I might as well. And I picked up a set of these Allen keys with a socket tool set. And we'll need the five millimeter to gain access to these bolts right there. So, yeah. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to let this car cool down because I just got back from work. So I definitely have to let this thing cool down before I can start touching it. It's a lot easier to change it, the PCV valve, when you're doing the spark plug. Because the intake manifold has to come off in order to get to this side. So in order to get to this side of the bolt we have to remove this bolt um this one i don't think you have to really remove it and then you need a five millimeter allen key socket for this one one right here one right here one right here and then one all the way back here and then another one right there and one right there so once you get all that removed and then you come to this side disconnect this uh disconnect this hose disconnect this hose and then unbolt this one. This, uh, I think this is a 12 millimeter. And then disconnect the wire from the manifold. And then there should be an extra set of wire, one wire in the back that's connected. And then you could just take it off and then you should be all set to go.
So I hope you guys enjoyed today's simple maintenance. Okay, well, not simple, but complex maintenance. I hope you guys really enjoyed. And it's actually a good idea just to start doing this to your car. Uh, just get this out of the way so you guys can improve the MPG since the gas prices are rising. So it's the, it's the best thing to do. So I hope you guys enjoyed and peace out.